Good evening. My name is Jennifer Jones, and I'm here to explain to you how the Life Leaf Foundation can help our community. Life Leaf Foundation is here to provide awareness to sickle cell anemia. The background on the Life Leaf Foundation is it's a nonprofit organization um, that was designed by me, Jennifer Jones, to um, to raise awareness to sickle cell anemia. Um, the mission is to educate those who do not know about sickle cell and also raise money for research. The time clock symbol is meant for um, time doesn't heal everything. So that's the sign that we decided to go with because sometimes diseases don't go away and you're stuck with them for a lifelong time. What is sickle cell anemia? Sickle cell anemia is a blood disorder that um, affects the hemoglobin blood cells. Um, due to that affecting the hemoglobin blood cells, um, the cells are sickle and they have trouble going through the body, moving through like regular blood flow like you and I, which causes it to sickle, which can cause pain crisis. Um, sickle cell anemia is mostly an African descent disease. Um, however, there it is also found in Hispanics um, and those of the Mediterranean, Middle East, Eastern um, area. Um, a lot of people do not know that they have sickle cell anemia, so um, possibly finding a trait, finding out that they have the trait would help out. Um, the purpose is that there's currently no organizations in Rochester, New York, as of right now. Um, the Life Life the Life Life Foundation would be here to help us to, um, like I said, provide uh, research, raise money for research, and to provide uh, educating people on the um, actual disease, to possibly eliminate cystophobia. The date that I came up with would be April 9th to possibly get this started due to that being my son's birthday and the day of me finding out that he has sickle cell disease. Um, two spokespersons came to my mind, which is Tiani Tebaz Watson and Candy Burroughs. Um, um, Tebaz has sickle cell disease, so she would be a great spokesperson to talk about um, the effects and what it had on her body and all the things that she had to go through as a child growing into an adult. The second person that I picked would be Candy due to her um, fiance dying due to uh, sickle cell. So she can also briefly share some pain crises that he may have went through that she went through with him. Planning the budget. Due to sickle cell being very expensive, I uh, came up with a few ways of trying to raise $5,000 for the research of sickle cell every month. Um, in conclusion, the Likely Foundation has been founded in an effort to provide sickle cell awareness. We are a small nonprofit organization currently located in Rochester, New York. The organization is, be is at the beginning stages and is looking to expand to Atlanta, Georgia. Thank you.